Speed and coordination are key for our effectiveness. Last year we had a major operation here with 6,000 officers, including federal police and police officers from other German states. If something goes wrong in an operation like that, every second counts. No way can you do it without reliable radio. From the very beginning, when we first started setting up the Tetra network, we decided on microwave technology for the backhaul network, because it's an established fact that microwave technology can guarantee higher availability than leased lines, especially in states covering large areas. Here we have a kind of double ring architecture. All of the base stations have dual connections. That is, there are two completely separate pathways to the exchange. Even if one of them fails, we still have a connection. We have everything in our own hands and can decide on the best technology. We have our own field force so we can take direct action to ensure full availability. Right now we're converting the entire backhaul to a packet-based data network and with it we can transfer everything we need to. One good example of how the additional capacity of packet microwave technology can be exploited are video transmissions, for instance for forest fire monitoring systems. Or in large-scale operations we set up connections to the site of the operation, so the officers on duty have the same services available in their mobile ops room as at their police station. Just a short while ago, in summer, a huge storm front swept through Lower Saxony, and we in the control center had to alert over a hundred fire brigades. In cases like that, it's vitally important that radio telephony contact can be established with all of these fire brigades immediately after alerting them, to tell them where to go and what to expect there. Be it flooded cellars, tiles that have been blown off roofs, or simply branches that have broken off a tree somewhere and are blocking the road, the radio link is particularly important then. A very important performance feature of our packet-based backhauling systems is adaptive modulation. By means of adaptive modulation, the systems detect, fully automatically and without any outside intervention, that there are rain obstacles in the radio field. And then they change the modulation so that the data is transmitted more slowly, but speech data transmission still has priority. A big advantage with the implementation of the new packet microwave technology is that it doesn't impact the existing network. We don't need to turn off any lines. That can be done during operation, so it's a lot more economical. The future looks good. We've already converted most of the network to the new technology, so it can now support more and new applications and the next generation digital radio network. We feel confident that we can provide first responders with the multimedia tools and the reliability they'll need.